Alright guys, so we're gonna finish season one of the sim. If you guys want season two, then I'll give it to you. I might even do season two in this video because I got buckets of time. And when I mean buck and when I say buckets I mean them. I'm not gonna put this all into one videos, but this is probably yeah, this is gonna be two videos, so yeah. Just applying some new components, cause they age out. I could actually use this one probably, and no, it's not worth taking a risk. Whoa, whoa, no, 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 no. All right, there we go. Yeah, but if you don't remember, the standings are Lewis in P1, Russell in P2, Verstappen in P3, Lando in P4, and Charles Leclerc in position 5. Our new parts have completed without issue. They'll be on the car ready for the next race weekend. Oh yeah, the for the constructors. It's Mercedes. Oh yeah. <laughs> And Red Bull kind of got... Actually, no. They, Red Bull did get definitely a boost there. But, yeah, no. We're not currently in a rivalry. Sooner or later, you'll probably be asked by the media who you consider to be a rival. Think carefully who you select. Because while you'll Jeez. receive a claim of you, you'll lose a claim if you fail to do so. We suck. <laughs> What happened? We flatlined. How many of our developments failed? Oh, yeah, season break. Of course. Oh, yeah, I forgot. Nothing happened. Hey, boss. I think we could better manage our time by organizing some team activities. I already did that. Shut up. Shut up! Whatever. Please don't tell me the updates fail. What do you mean? I already clicked it. In. But um, I'm hoping that Logan Sargent was a good signing. I would be good with the, uh, for this team because. We're all rooting for this team, right? So, yeah. I just hope he's a good signing. Let's swim through this. Alright, Dutch Grand Prix results. If Max Verstappen doesn't win this, then Lewis Hamilton is getting burnt. And, I mean, by burnt, I mean booed. I'm just kidding. Ah. Oh... But Lewis is pro would probably get very, very booed. If for if for Sappen doesn't get a podium, then I'll be shocked. He got double lapped. People in the points got lapped. What is happening? With this. Alright, so we've got like a bunch of races left. I think Hamilton might have already sealed the driver's champ. I mean, I think Mercedes have definitely already sealed the constructors. Unless Red Bull pulls... A undefeated streak. The team is actually flatlining. Like, I'm scared for the team. Like, what is happening to Defiance F1 team? Because we have cash. So. And we're gonna get some big sponsor buddy here. So I might have to step in. Like, so... If the team, 
does it have like massive improvement anytime soon then I'm gonna have to get some stuff done At least put out a decent car out there. Like, if you're not in the points, that's fine. See, again, they're not even in the top 14. P19 and P21. This gray cell here, man. It's disrespectful to racing. Again? Oh my god. Alright, that should be it. Rest of the season. At least we're better than Haas and Alpha Tauri. Alright, we have another chassis update. Yup, those updates failed. All right, I'm, I'm gonna have to step in because this is getting ridiculous. All right, curse settings on and on. Bing, bap, RD, chassis. Buy that. We aren't able to afford this. Is there anything else that we could afford? No. But, you know what we can do? We can. Sign a new sponsor. So, introducing. So, we're gonna sign somebody. Huh. Funny. <sighs> Driver of the day. Qualified B15 or better. Getting gob... No, I'm not even gonna try. Echo. Distort. Well, yeah, no, I'm not racing, so. Don't mind if I do. <laughs> that laugh was dumb. No, it wasn't. I'm all jokes, all jokes. The car actually came out really good, so. Well, I distort here. Well, I distort here. We might have to kick Cat Quest out, but here's our new car. It's pretty good. Not that we've added distort to it. That's it. All right. Okay, we've had the new parts come through the fabrication process. We'll have them with us for the next Grand Prix. We're never not going to be last. We're never not going to be last. What is happening? This team desperately needs a R and D like um thing. So. What is there called again? The R&D restart? We'll just call it a restart, I guess. I'm gonna finish this water.
All right, that was some good water. I got the lemon water from Core, whatever they call. Yeah, Core. Core hydration plus minus uh, Pyagrium theorem. <laughs> what is happening? All right. Verstappen won a race. He got lapped. What in the world? Both of us got double lapped. What in the world is happening? Do they have like maxed out cars? Do we just suck? What is going on? Are we just like not trying? Bro, look how much money we have in that R and D thing. Look how much R and D points that we have. No, nah, cause I'm oh. So we just ain't finna talk about that. Alright, so but let's handle this. So what are end plates up we'll have an end plates update. And chassis normally gets updates, so I could barely afford that. That had a 30% failure chance as well, but look how big it'll take us. How far it'll take us. So I guess here goes nothing. If all of our updates happen, we will just be better than Alpha Tauri. If all of our updates come to for which so the entire development package for the weekend not good sorry for yelling but seriously horrible horrible water noises all right we're gonna be singing no we're not. I might, but probably not. Does that count as singing? I don't know. Why did they make the Belgium track so short? And by short, I mean long. And by long, I mean how many laps. And by laps, I mean short. So there's a short amount of laps because the circuit is way too long. Why can't they make the circuit shorter, though? Like what? Wouldn't that make more sense? And so that was Japan. Russell won that. That's new. Yeah, but I'm pretty sure Lewis is very close to sealing. And Mercedes have probably been sealed that. But there is a slight fight for fourth. Alright, how many times did people get lapped this time? It's only P12, which is good, I guess. But I'm going to turn it down to 27, so... Because I feel like the shorter races are more realistic. Because they don't have as much lapping. Money go. No, nah, I don't have any sim, so uh oh iPhone ringtones. We could catch up to Alpine, but that would mean that we have to get a point, which is something that this team most likely isn't able to do, and that I know failed. We're some new developments to come through, but some of them have failed quality control. We'll need to the? tell the team what to redevelop via the R&D screen. Again. Failure. Great. Great. Now we're going to have to redo this. It's coming in October. 
Oh. You know what? I can't be getting mad over this. Like, this team is trying me, though. It be trying me. <laughs> but we did get a small upgrade, though. At, well, in between Singapore and Guitar. So that part failed. So now it's uh, Lucille. Isn't that where the World Cup was? Was that the exact city or was it a different city? Eh, I don't know. Oh, I might. Br I'm gonna bring that back. Portugal, most likely. But I don't know why it was at the end of the season. But I guess it's good for traveling. So, like, so, um, Interlagos, then Portugal, in the middle of those two. So, I guess that makes sense. If you... Um... One or two... That video is doing pretty well. Please don't say that I jinxed that. I really hope I didn't. Hamilton won the sprint. Obviously. Alright, who got lapped? If you get lapped during a sprint race, then... There's nothing that could possibly save you. How did you get lapped during a sprint race? How did you get lapped during a sprint race? Now it's time for the race act. Um, mo uh, money people, I mean Qatar. Because they don't really be giving out the money, they just be saving it for the themselves. But I'm gonna uh, change the session after this. But I'm not racing, so it doesn't really, really matter like that. It's not really that important. <sighs> I don't know to go. Oh well. Loading screen. Why is the loading screen taking so long? That was good. You have to have it. That was very good. Finally! Let's have a look then at the driver's standings. Despite the best efforts of our championship leader, the lead has taken a bit of a knock today. It's another clear win for Mercedes as they managed to secure the constructors' title. And they just secured it? For the whole team. There's no way they just secured it. They must have been secured it. <sighs> Why was that video on? Huh. Sorry, I was just 
looking at something. I was looking some racing stuff up. And that failed. Just like a lot of things about this team. All failed. Oh yeah, I forgot to turn on CPU. My bad. Apologies, apologies, apologies. Sorry. Um... I know we were expecting some new developments to come through, but some of them have failed quality control. The text is Grand Prix. <laughs> ah, yeah, it's always funny reading what they call it. The text is Grand Prix. Funny. Okay, I need your attention. The tech regulations are changing. There's a risk some of our hard work will be undone, so we need to mitigate it. Hey, uh, yeah, 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 yeah. Hey, yeah. that's my, not my job. That ain't my job. I am simulating. I am not the one. Not the one. That's my song. It's a good song. Hold on. All right. Um, I'm back. Just had a little minor interruption but I have returned oh yeah this is a sprint weekend is it yeah, okay yeah I know it is the USA is a sprint weekend for some reason and what happened to George Russell I mean no trust. They all use one tire. Race director. Sprint. I swear to God. What happened to the one laps? Okay, there's no one laps. First step and crashed. It's over. It's now a oh, Mercedes title fight. But I wonder what ha what's going to happen for next season with the new regs. Regs stand for regulation changes, by the way. So uh, we have new a new chassis system, as your reminder, since um, I wasn't here, so I got to remember this stuff. Dude. All right, I'm gonna sing to take getting bored, and I don't have a song to sing. But um, I also got some big business stuff to do with at the moment, at the very second. So I'm doing that while making this video. Yeah, no. Because I'm starting a new project. Great result for Lewis Hamilton, who moves and further ahead at the top of the table. So let's see what effect has Hamilton on the standings. It's another clear win for Mercedes as they manage to secure the constructors' title. They've and already done that. For the whole team. I'm equal parts exhausted and elated with this weekend of Formula One. So be sure to join us for the next one. All right, Hamilton has 67 points ahead of him. But that McLaren actually improved a big lot. Yeah, but... So that's happening. Uh, 
I don't really care. R&D is automated, of course. So this could probably survive until, like, Vegas. I guess. But Lando and P5 is actually surprising because that McLaren was a very was a very good car. That McLaren is the best car right now. We are dead last. We were in that mid card, and then we just spiked down. Like, but. Like, it should start to set in, like it does at the end of the season normally, who the real uh, best teams and drivers are. But we have six mil in the bank. We need to be spending some of that cash, for real. Because, like, it's, it's weird. They, they cheap with it. They be keeping all them cash. I just hope it don't go to the wrong place. Hmm. Jokes, jokes, jokes. This team is supposed to be a clean team. Rooting for the underdog. But. Yeah, no, just handling some business stuff and. I'm enjoying myself though. Alright, that's... Alright, that's all of the business stuff that I need to conduct. So... Yeah, no, but I'm pretty sure Lewis has won the title. Mercedes has had a good car all season, and Lewis has just been liked. On a whole nother level. And when I say it, I mean it, too. Damage deductions. I must have got into a crash, I guess. Wonder who was. I didn't really see that I wasn't really just skipping by. Have to buy some more new parts towards the end of the season. And that's Logan Sargent, who are upgrading by a lot. Defiance is an American team. The second American team in Formula One. But yeah, no, we get to change our settings, so I might get rid of Quest. But then again, it might not be necessary. So I'll have to decide that sometime later on. But we have to get rid of these busy stuff. So we gotta simulate this. As well, cause Brazil's a pretty good circuit. So we could see some drama, we could see some... Mercs outside of P1 and P2. Merc stands for Mercedes. Because some of my fans are very new to racing. I know this firsthand. Hey, 
nobody got lapped, and it's Logan Sargent MP22 again. 22 out of 22. Last place, so that's great. But I turned icons on, so they c should be available, so I might have to use one of them. So, you yeah, know, we're up being dating our gearbox. So, I wonder if the update will do anything as we're, as we've pretty much caught up to, um, what would I call it again? Uh, Alpha Romeo, who will be Audi soon enough. Wonder what's going on outside. It's none of my business. So I don't really care. But it sounds fun. No, it doesn't, not at all. It's a great result for Lewis Hamilton, who moves further ahead at the top of the table. It's another clear win for Mercedes as they manage to secure the Constructors' title. An incredible performance for the whole team. And with that, we wrap up another weekend of motorsport action. But with more races lined up, be sure to join us. Well, yep, and that's the driver's sealed for Lewis as well. It'll be Lewis. Hold on, I'll be back for a second. Just going to take another recording break. All right, I'm finally finishing this video off. So we we simulate Las Vegas, and then we simulate Abu Dhabi, and then we might go to the off-season. I might simulate the off-season. I don't know if we're keeping Logan Sargent or not. But, uh, yeah, uh, reminder... There is a chassis R&D um, reset. And since I don't want people to get that lap that much because it looks really weird, so we'll make it long. All right. Let's get to simulation. Practice grease him. Quality grease him. But da da. But da 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 why do the teams look so dang much? Why are we so dooky? Bap, bap, bap. Why is Logan so trash? I call that the Formula Road song. Alright, and Abu Dhabi is our last race of the year. And we're getting rid of Logan Sargent. <laughs> if Logan Sargent manages to finish... Alright, I'll tell you what. If Logan Sargent manages to finish in the top 15, we'll keep him. Matter of fact, if he doesn't finish in the bottom three, then he stays. But if he does, then then we're then he's out. I'm sorry. There's there's no more excuses to keep him. Why are my hands so old? Ugh. Don't enjoy that. 
This character's 21, but his hands look like he's 50. Alright. And let's see how season one ends. We already know that I'm pretty sure it's Hamilton doing the donuts at the end of the year. So Hamilton's won the drivers, Mercedes has won the constructors. But we'll get to see the final standings, so I'm pretty sure the standings will be Mercedes, McLaren, Red Bull, Ferrari. And Russell won the race. But it definitely was not enough. But Red Bull and McLaren stopped in my assumption there. But Aston Martin kind of fell apart at the end of the season. But yeah, no, uh, we're going to need to make a big signing. And since we're part of the Renault engine, I have an idea. I just, we just. Sooner or later, you'll probably be asked by the media who you consider to be your rival. Think carefully who you select. That's why you'll receive a claim for beating them. You'll lose a claim if you fail to do so. However, I want to establish an alliance with the Mercedes Driver Academy, so Albon of Williams, you're coming with us, baby. Large bit, large bit. Drive up the cash early. See if Williams have a counter for it. We're splashing the cash here. For big spenders. Yes! We might have overpaid for him, but I don't care. He's so such a good driver. He's a 95 overall. And the R&D reset, we might be up there this season because chassis is like one of the most important parts of F1. So, finish, advance. So, we're gonna have to get rid of Quest as well. But I don't know if we will, though, because I feel like this season we might have those points that they request. And remove, remove, add. Yeah, no, that's a good race season. Nope, never mind. No, it isn't. Not at all. And we'll get rid of back you. We'll add you. Which means I will also get rid of Miami. And we'll get rid of Spade as well. So I guess we'll add Portugal in between those two. At Portimao. And I gotta edit some of these things. You are now you. Ha <laughs> ha. Yeah, feel me. <laughs> so, yeah, no, we're a part of the Mercedes Driver Academy. So, Williams and Aston Martin. <sighs> we share drivers with them the most. My remote just fell, but it's okay. We're all okay. You know, after the R&D reset, you know, not much changed. 
But I'm hoping that changed. We get some upgrades. Had a grid of car, but that is going to Bonded be it. Be we have new parts. And we have a chassis upgrade. Ooh, me likey. But that's it for today's episode. And and if you guys want to see season two, then um, yeah, no. All right, well, I'll do that.